hello there welcome back so now you know how to create gray blur sepia and invert effect using css image filters so now in this model we are going to learn about how to decrease opacity of any images okay so for that let's go to uh, editor okay and create a page uh, called opacity dot html okay and go to invert copy it paste it here and let's remove this class name and change this to opacity and go to our style page and now here in style sheet let's add opacity page or you can just say filters right <laughs> well opacity is not a filter it's type of effect that's really i want to show you okay so it's opacity and let's add a class that opacity on image and here you don't need to add filter just opacity is enough okay and you can put any decimal numbers like one is 100 percent a normal image and if you just decrease it like 0 0.5 0 0.3 then it will be going to decrease opacity so let's make it 0 0.5 okay and now get back to opacity html and just take a live look okay so now you can see this is opacity okay it decreases so let's make it uh, visible on hover it's normal visible so for that let's save our some time copy it paste it here okay and now you can see on hover opacity is one okay so let's get back to here and now you can see on hover its opacity going to be fully normal 100 percent okay so you can see this is really awesome and if we just decrease it to zero it will be going to be like you know you see it's disappear okay this is how it look like <laughs> so this is really awesome and this is how opacity work okay so let's make it uh, 50 percent okay and um, same i just uh, I just press on my keyboard print screen and go back to MS Paint paste it here crop it crop it resize it to 60% sorry it's 60 pixel <laughs> and save here is uh, here let's put opacity okay close it get back to our editor or in opacity and here we go copy it paste it change this to opacity okay and here's also its opacity and this is also its opacity okay and copy it go to invert paste it save it paste it and save it go to sepia paste it save it paste it and save it okay so now you done okay so you can see this gray blur sepia invert and here is a opacity okay so thank you so much and see you in the next module